Last week, Congressman Bill Johnson was picked to be the next president of Youngstown State. Since then, organizations like the YSU Foundation have expressed concerns about people being reluctant to support the university. Well, today I talked with Congressman Johnson about those concerns and others that people have raised. A conversation with Bill Johnson is our top story tonight at 11. Sitting this afternoon in Youngstown State's Board of Trustees meeting room, Congressman Bill Johnson said he has no intention of withdrawing as president. No, no, I'm, I'm, I'm going to be president of Youngstown. I, well, I've got a contract that says I'm going to be, and, uh, and soon. From the moment Johnson was introduced, he's heard the criticism. People say that I'm, I'm this, that, or the other, and there's no foundation of truth in, in any of that. If they would just sit down and talk to me first and then draw their conclusion, I think, uh, I think we'd be a lot further down the road. Johnson told of a YSU student who emailed him yesterday, wondering why something didn't fit with what people were saying. So Johnson called him. He said, my God, you're calling me? I said, yeah. I said, because you're the reason that I'm doing this. You're a student. Of all the people critical of Johnson becoming president, how many have contacted him directly? None of them. And that includes Bruce Zoldan and Ed Moransky. Both of them have my phone number. Neither one of them have called me. So I, I, you know, I don't even know what to say about that, Stan. I, I have worked well with both of them. I've helped both of them uh, over the years. Johnson says he was first approached by a search firm. Well, my first reaction was, why would I do that? Why, why would I do that? I love what I do. I'm not looking for another job. But then Johnson started hearing about the culture from his son and nephew who attend YSU and from the people who run the university. And there came a point when he changed his mind. When it became clear to me that, that they were looking for uh, a leader with, with life skills. The congressman and soon to be president has some lofty goals. Of making Youngstown State University not just a school in Northeast Ohio, but the anchor university of Northeast Ohio. I want the other research universities across this state to be looking at Youngstown State through the windshield, not in the rearview mirror. Bill Johnson said someone in Washington told him he's now one of 435 trying to make a difference, but at Youngstown State, he'll be one of one. He realizes he'll be the man everybody's looking to, but he says he's extremely happy, honored, and humbled to be the next president. Hi, everyone. I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.